power comes in from the electricity, DC electricity comes into the system and into this DC disconnect, then goes into the inverter and converts it from AC or DC to AC. Um, there's two solar trackers out there. We have an inverter for each tracking um, so that we can independently monitor each separate array. Uh, this one is currently making 34, 3600. This one's making 2,500, showing that at different angles will actually generate more electricity, having a steeper angle in the, in the, in the winter time, which is now December 15th, which means that you're close to the worst, ang lowest angle of the sun on the eastern seaboard. It does better if you're at a steep angle over 50 degrees versus at a less of a pitch of a 15 degree pitch. Um, from there, the electricity is sent into a uh, electrical panel that is then feed, fed into the electrical panel of the house. Um, we put both AC and DC lightning arresters, so the equipment is protected from the DC side, which is the array, as well as from the house side for electrical shocks. Um, we put in a data monitoring system, which is a, the data logger, which logs all of the data from both of those inverters and goes out through a monitoring device called Fat Spaniel that allows us to monitor as well as the homeowner to monitor their electrical generation 24 hours a day, seven days a week and allows us to, it's independent third party monitoring for the renewable energy credits so that the customer's generating credits and we're able to track it online.